I competed in the London Youth Games in the early 90s and I just remember it being one of the highlights of the year. I mean, now it's like the UK's largest competition. It was the fact that you were part of this team and that you were kind of all in it together. So you did your event and then you rushed to go and see, you know, your friends or even people you hadn't met but who were just from the same county as you competing. I remember having a great time coming in on the coach with the other kids and just having a really good time here. I think the first time I came to the Games I was picked for the Newham team to play netball. It's always been good coming back. A new level. A new level. Ready! Come on, Sutton! Inspirational because there was lots of sports going on and I really enjoyed it. It was good because we got to have a go at something we'd never done before. We've uh, played lots of matches and it's just been very good. The London Youth Games are so important for young children in London particularly because there are so many children who don't have access to sport, be it at an elite level or just at a very general level. The people have started off here to like take in these sports further but this is like the stepping stone to that. You don't see enough like sporting events for young people really. And yeah, it's great for like encouraging young people to do more sport. The kids need it, the kids love it, and it, it's creating future, it's creating future stars. So some dreams are being made into reality because of people getting behind it, like how completely. <laughs> It was the pinnacle of my beginning, really, for, um, for my athletics career. Taking me to Olympics, Commonwealth Games, silver medal, and um, being able to travel the world. And it all started at London Youth Games. Probably for some of them, it's like a mini Olympics, you know. But it, it, it's great, it really is kind of mind-blowing. I used to play uh, in it about, say, about five years ago, and I played for Bromley Borough and we uh, managed to win it, and it was against my, um, my actual own borough, which is Lewisham, where I'm from. I miss this tournament a lot, because obviously now I'm too old to play in it. You know, we know for a fact that there are some future champions here. There's, you know, I competed here, Christine Ovakuru competed here, Lil Deng competed here. So we know today that there are some stars here, and I'd like to be here to see them. <laughs> I think the London Youth Games has evolved into something massive. I mean, I remember it being pretty important, but you go along today and all these events, it's got spectators now. Before it was just parents, but now people come along to watch, you know, the children at the highest level compete. So the evolution's been massive. My dad's come along with me today because he loved it so much when I played in it. He said, oh, let's come and have a look and see what it's about again. So, and again, it's been another great day. You have uh, a lot to gain. It's a great atmosphere here. I'd uh, love coming even if I wasn't competing in anything. The Balfour BT London Games. It's a fantastic opportunity. See the different sports, meet loads of different people, you know, enjoy competing, whether you, you know, win, lose or draw. Look around you, there's hockey going on, there's athletics going on, there's gymnastics and it's kids and some of these young athletes will keep doing what they're doing because of the experience that they had here. 